I'm thankful to everyone who donated and everyone who's shared and everyone who's helped. And now I just, I want to make people's lives a little bit better. So this one, yeah? So this is the first one. It looks good. Pacho dish. Pacho dish. Pacho dish. This is the receipt. We paid for it. And this is how much we're getting. 430 packets. And this is just the rice. Manas <laughs> It's currently 20 minutes till midnight. We're going out to give these blankets. We decided to go to Silet Railway Station where we heard there are a lot of people sleeping rough. Once we got there, I was overwhelmed by the amount of people sleeping on the platforms and on the tracks. <laughs> Yes, Yeah. 
We have another 150 left to give out, but we gave out 50 today. But yeah, it's a good result. And it's people actually sleeping on the streets. Like, I didn't think I'd find anyone sleeping on the streets, but people are actually sleeping.
this camera please there are two friends. Oh, do you know? Be joined. 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 I distributed these blankets myself so that I could ensure that they were going to those who needed it most.
good that I was able to make a difference. I've done this today as I understand that poor people are in need and since we're all in such a privileged position I feel like we have the facilities to be able to give. I've raised nearly £3,000 with the help of my friends and family in order to feed about 200 people here. I'm thankful to everyone who shared, to everyone who's donated and to everyone who's helped make this happen. We should work together to make their life a bit easier, whereas we are in a very privileged position. Once again, I would like to thank each and every one of you who have contributed to this fundraising initiative. This experience has been a real eye-opener for me and it's given me an insight into some of the lives of the less fortunate and the difficulties that they face. 